Hello world, welcome back to my channel. Today I am on a pop hunt. I think it's pop hunt number 21, I might be wrong. I have two special guests today. Would you guys like to introduce yourselves? Hi. Hi. I'm Katie. I think you've both been in an episode before, but that's Alicia and Katie in case you forget their names. But anyways, today we're at the mall. I'm looking for San Diego Comic Con exclusives at Hot Topic and lunch, Box Lunch. And I think there's some at Barnes & Noble too. Um, I think today's the second day of the releases, so I'm not gonna get my hopes up because they might be all gone, but let's take a look anyways. You guys ready? Yes. Yep. Let's do this. Hot Topic time, let's do this. So they have the two that I was looking for. They actually have a lot, look at all of those. Here's the other ones they have. They have a lot here. Like they didn't waste any space. You guys gonna get any? I'm definitely getting these two right here. So their wall here is absolutely huge. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but like they have so much stuff. What are you looking at, Katie? So do you guys think Katie should collect Naruto Pops? Like the video if you think she should. No. I think she should. They have the Lion King Pops that I just reviewed. Um, they have the Little Mermaid. I don't see the King Trident. That was a, I think that was a Hot Topic exclusive. I don't see it. They have a lot of Aladdin Pops left. A lot of Toy Story left. Um, what else? Spider-Man Far From Home up there. Black Panther. But yeah, I can't believe all the San Diego Comic Con ones they had. I think I'm gonna get this one with my hot cash. I need it. Let's go, I'm ready. <laughs> so I'm in box lunch. I'm not seeing a single San Diego Comic Con pop. Such a bummer. I was so excited for these ones specifically, but I'm not seeing any. I'm gonna have to ask. I'm just kidding, they're behind the counter. They have Moana and Forrest Gump, which I'm definitely gonna get, but I don't see the up ones, I'm so upset. So we're in box lunch and look at this little bag. It is the freaking mailbox from up. I'm dead. This store's killing us. You all right, Katie? No. She wants to buy like 17 Everything. things. Yes. I do too, like look at all this stuff. There's so much stuff. Look at that backpack and they got pops. <gasps> oh my God, I need. So they do have Forrest Gump back here, I didn't notice. Um, they also have the regular one as well. And behind the counter they have Moana and a few others, but I'm only interested in this one and Moana. They don't have the up ones though, which I'm really upset about, but it's fine. Um, they have the SpongeBob ones. They have the new Scooby-Doo ones, which I really like, but I probably won't be getting. Toy Story, Aladdin, Lion King, um, Endgame, same stuff. Really not too much new, except for the exclusives. <laughs> <laughs> so we're in Barnes and Noble now. Um, I'm done for the day. I don't know if you guys saw my all my stuff, but um, I blame these two right here. They they forced me to uh, to buy some pops that I didn't need, but I got them really cheap with my hot cash. So I'm not even mad. Um, we're in Barnes and Noble now. I'm not seeing any of the exclusives for San Diego Comic Con. I'm not getting any because I'm done. Um, you getting anything, Katie? I, I'm I'm my wallet man they have a giant wall back here oh i can't wait for the christmas disney ones uh, winnie the pooh i'm ready pooh. oh my crap i hate myself i'll show you guys what i got later it's it's a lot Ooh, what is this okay red skull versus cap um i like that i don't need it though that's cool though i love red skull uh, huh? Oh. <laughs> okay. Wow. Harry Potter? No, it doesn't even make noise. I'm not a Harry Potter person, so I don't know. Potter. <laughs> they got some Aladdin, you know, the basics. They got the Mickey. Three for 25, which is all right. It used to be three for 20, but I won't say nothing. Oh, that's cool. I mean, I'm not a Star Wars person, but that's kind of cool. Nothing else, really. I didn't see any of the San Diego exclusives. Whatever, I wasn't getting any anyways. I, I gotta get out of here. Hey guys, so I'm back home. Uh, normally at the end of my pop hunts, I will record everything that I got um, in my car, but it is literally like a million degrees outside here, so I didn't want to sit in my car and do a review, so I just thought I'd do it now. Don't mind my cat sitting there, she's just wagging her tail. But anyways, um, the first stop was Hot Topic. I found two of the limited edition exclusives that I wanted from the San Diego Comic Con, which uh, was Mr. Prickle Pants from Toy Story, which is probably one of my favorites from the newest um, 
limited edition pops. And then I found Quasimodo. I'm I'm probably saying is wrong. Just correct me if I am. I haven't watched this movie in years, but I, I wanted the pop really bad. Um, but I'm really glad I found these two. I really wasn't interested in any other of the Hot Topic exclusives. Um, so together, I think those were $27 because I had a $5 off. Um, I guess it was a reward for being a Hot Topic member. But yeah, these two were $27. Um, then I went to Box Lunch. So like I said, um, our next stop was Box Lunch. Um, when you guys saw in the video, I first walked in, I didn't see any of the exclusives, but I was literally dumb. They were literally behind the cash register, like behind the desk. So I had to get it from the cashier. They were all behind there. Um, when I walked in, I really wanted three. I had three in mind. It was these two and it was the Ellie and Carl Pops, which I'm really sad I didn't get. But they said they only got a few in stock and they sold out pretty quick. But they had a ton of these two. Um, so I picked up Forrest Gump. He's like in his running attire with his beard. Uh, I really like this one. Forrest Gump is one of my all-time favorite movies. I know I said I mainly collect Marvel and Disney, but I do make some exceptions like for, for pops like these. And then, probably my favorite pop of the whole day, this Moana pop. I guess it's called the Pop Rides, right? Um, but it is so cool. Um, let me take it out of the box for you. So, honestly, this is one of the best pops I own. It is so detailed and cool. I love how they have Hey Hey and the pig. Um, it just looks so cool. I love her sail. Um, I wish I had, like, a backdrop of this. Oh, there's probably one. In, yeah, there's one in the box. I just think it's, like, the coolest pop ever. Definitely my favorite pop ride that I own. Uh, Moana is so iconic, and this pop is just so detailed. Um, definitely one of the best um, exclusive pops for this hunt. So, I was leaving the mall, and then I totally forgot that I had hot cash. I had four hot caches for Hot Topic, so I went back into Hot Topic, and I was like, you know what? I just got paid today. I'm going to go all out. So... I found the rest of the Forrest Gump set. I am literally obsessed with this one, him with the chocolate. This is one of my favorite pops ever. Um, but I picked up these two. Uh, what other ones did I get? There, there's a whole bunch. This is going to be a big one. Um, so there's these two. I'll put these to the side. And then I figured I really like Aladdin, so I'm going to pick this up. Um, I think it was it was, I think it was like 32 or 35 somewhere around there. I paid... I got 15 off on it, so that was a good deal as well. And I also got Cruella de Vil because she was only $15, plus she was 30% off. So I got her for really, really, really cheap. And I got one other thing from there. Let me show you. So this entire box of Aladdin stuff was like $11 on clearance. I am like amazed of what's in it. Let me show you. How do I open this? I keep forgetting how to open this thing. Is it right here? Oh, there we go. All right, so the box has like, um, that's just, it's so cute. And here's the stuff. There's like a little Abu toy, which is like, whatever, it's cute. Um, there's a little pen, which I think is adorable. There's a keychain of the lamp, which I absolutely love. I'm going to put that on my keys. And then there's this bad boy right here. Look at that. This, I cannot believe I got this for $11. I'm just, it's, it's unbelievable. I'm sorry, the lighting's terrible. But yeah, I had to pay $11 for this. Isn't that insane? So yeah, I think I did pretty good in Hot Topic. So all of this stuff together that I'm showing you here, together would have been around $126 after I did the calculations. I only paid $54 for all of this stuff. Thank you, Hot Cash. You are the best. You are incredible. I cannot wait to go pop hunting again in Hot Topic with Hot Cash. All right, guys, so this is my entire haul from the day. Thank you, Hot Cash, for saving me a ton of money and for getting me a whole bunch of cool pops. And I absolutely love the San Diego Comic-Con pops, especially this one here, just so beautiful. Um, there's those two as well, and four Scump. I only got four. I really wasn't into a lot of the SDCC pops this year. I don't know why. I wanted Wong from Endgame, but he's in a Walgreens exclusive, so I'll never find him. But anyways, thank you, thank you guys for watching this so much. If you liked it, please subscribe, comment, and like the video. I will have more pop hunts coming your way pretty soon, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!